Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Dory and I'm so glad that you're here. I've lost a total of 80 pounds and I have kept it off for a long time. I follow Bright Line Eating, which is a no flour, no sugar eating style. When you're watching my videos about food, fitness, and freedom, where it pertains to food, we're gonna be having no flour, no sugar foods. I've maintained my weight loss for a very long time for the first time ever in my life. I'm excited to be here with you today. A couple of things. As you're watching food recipes, you're gonna see something go off on the screen that's a trigger warning. That means I'm letting you know if there's a food in this recipe that's going to light up your brain and I'll give you some suggestions for that and to substitute. Next, as you're watching the video, there's gonna be timestamps in the description and at the bottom bar of the screen. That way you can bypass and fast forward to whatever section of the video that works for you. If you like this video and you wanna continue on with this journey, food, fitness, and freedom with me, be sure to subscribe and hit a thumbs up for a like on each of the videos you watch. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, it's been a full day in the kitchen. So here's the scoop. It's time for me to prepare dinner. So what am I going to have today for dinner? I am going to be having a what, what? What? Sometimes a girl just needs a cheeseburger. You know what I'm saying? You just sometimes need a cheeseburger. So we're gonna make a cheeseburger salad. I've prepared this many times and on my Instagram channel, it's another popular dish. So with this particular recipe, we're taking the beautiful uh, flavors and the fixins of the cheeseburger scenario and we're gonna make it into a salad. I also wanna give you a trigger warning here. Again, we have some cheese. So honor your choices, what you have peace around, and how you work your program. This particular cheeseburger salad is great for either lunch or dinner. Now I do a 10-10 split on my Bright Line Eating veggies. So when I make this now, I'm making it for dinner and I'm using 10 ounces of veggies in order to complete my protein. My protein, what am I talking about? My vegetable, my vegetable and I'm using a veggie burger today. As always, the ingredients, the process, and the whole kit and caboodle is gonna be down below in the description. So let's get to making this cheeseburger salad. And again, as always, because I'm a New Yorker and I like things quick, we're gonna make this easy, breezy, and fast. Let's go. Let's get started with our burger. I'm using a plant-based burger in the air fryer for 15 minutes. While that's happening, I will go ahead and start preparing my salad. I'm using spinach, arugula, tomatoes, and purple onions. I also have my pickles off to the side, which I'll dice as well. Next, it's the dressing. Using all of the ingredients listed below in the description, you'll mix it all together to make your cheeseburger-inspired dressing. All right, now that we have got that going on, it's time to mix it up and put it to the side while we flip our burger for another five minutes. Okay, it's time now to get it all together. I like to massage my salad with lots of different seasonings in order to get it flavorful. I do do a little spray as well, just so that the seasoning can stick to it all. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and massage the cheeseburger salad dressing that we just made into the lettuce. I'm not using it all, I'm just using a little bit at a time, making sure to save some for the end so I can drizzle it on top of the entire plate. Now, let's put this in our plate. It's gonna be nice and layered. I have a double layer here with pickles in the middle and pickles on top. And after we plate that, we'll go ahead and chop our, our burger and top it with the cheese and warm that up so that we can slide it onto this beautiful plate. So here we go, chopping up the burger into little bite-sized pieces, then topping it with the cheese and placing it in the microwave for 30 seconds or so so that you can melt the cheese. Easy breezy. After that's done, you are ready to slide this gorgeousness onto your plate. Then take the rest of your dressing, drizzle it on top, and you are all set for your cheeseburger salad. Thank <laughs> you. 
I just had to come back on because for real guys, this cheeseburger salad is bomb. Uh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Wow. Outdone myself, outdone myself here. See how you inspired me? You gotta try it. I'm using a plant-based burger, so I love it. Use what burger you want to use, but woo, this is good. And listen, if you don't do cheese, I get it. Try some cashew cheese. Mm. You can check out my Instagram for the recipe.